Support for NPR Music comes from Capital One, presenting sponsor of the 2024 Tiny Desk Contest. Browse entries today and share your favorites at tinydesk.npr.org. Capital One, what's in your wallet? most recent solo violin work uh, that Missy wrote for me. This is going to be a set where we're kind of exploring the 15-year collaborative friendship that we've had. Um, and it's been an amazing process to see Missy's work and how she's developed and evolved. Um, and I think she's really one of the great composers of our day, and I am so grateful to be able to call her my friend and collaborator. So here's Missy Mazzoli. Thank you so much. Um, this is awesome. This is a dream. It's such a dream to be here playing on this just vital, important series, um, especially with one of my favorite people and one of my most trusted collaborators. Um, as Jenny mentioned, that first piece was called Hail Horrors Hail. And that's actually from Jenny's um, recent album, Alone Together, which won a Grammy for Best Solo Performance and was a pandemic era project. Yeah. <laughs> and was a pandemic era project where Jenny commissioned um, some of her long-term collaborators, but also a lot of up and coming young composers all to write solo pieces for her that she recorded in your living room or, you know, yeah. so <laughs> in, in, during, during the, the height of the pandemic. Um, this next work uh, is actually our most recent uh, large scale collaboration. This work is called Procession and it actually began its life as a violin concerto that we premiered, that Jenny premiered with the National Symphony back in 2022. And this is a work that I wrote that was inspired by medieval healing rituals. So um, processions, spells, ecstatic dances, um, those sorts of things. And we're going to play uh, just one of the movements. This is the final movement of that concerto, and this is called Procession Ascending. And the original version was, of course, for violin and orchestra, and I've arranged it uh, to be something that we can play together. Yay. <laughs> 
You. That was one of the first times we've ever played that for anybody. So it's <laughs> thrilling and terrifying in all the best ways. Um, the, for this next piece, we're going to go all the way back to the very first piece that I ever wrote for Jenny, which was back in 2009 um, as part of her Bach and Beyond project. This is a project where Jenny commissioned a bunch of composers to create works that were inspired by specific pieces by Bach. And so this is a work called Dissolve, Oh My Heart, and it's inspired by the famous Bach Chaconne for solo violin.
So that was Dissolve, Oh My Heart. Uh, that was the first piece that Missy wrote for me. Um, so then it's like clear, right? <laughs> I would want to work with her more. Um, but uh, coming up is Hail Horse Hail. No, coming up is Kinski Paganini. <laughs> coming up is Kinski Paganini. Um, so it's really an honor to be able to play Missy's music here. Uh, she is the first of two women to be commissioned by the Metropolitan Opera. Um, this is a fun set to have the opportunity to do because this is the most kind of personal and intimate things that she writes, which is for solo instruments. Um, but she also writes incredibly large and grand scale things um, like opera which is huge and dramatic and wonderful. Um, and yeah, she was Grammy nominated as well for her CD for Best Composer. Um, and okay, here's Kinski. I get more nervous about talking than flying, so. <laughs> Thank you. 